Zero eleven here. And today, we got some more mail from guess who? We got a package from James. But before we get to the package, I have a mild frick up here. Again, this happens a lot, but I'm pretty sure I'm supposed to send this to somebody, but I forgot and I just found it recently. So if you're the person I'm supposed to send this to, message me. Again, this happens a lot with the cheaper cards. Like, I just completely forget about them. So, so there's that. Yeah, we got a package from James here. Not too big of a package here, but it's James. So we're jumping the queue for James and we'll give him his own video. Not sure if it's going to be that long though, but let's get on to the package from James. Oh. Okay, here we go. Oh my gosh. So here's the note, and we got a bunch of cards. Okay. Hey, Ziri. Congrats on making it to 50 mail videos. Thank you, James. Of course, James was actually number one. He's partly to blame for this amazing community we have, so he's number one, and we're now on 50-something mail videos, almost two years later now. Like, at first, it took a couple of months just to get a package, and now I'm months behind. Like, I'm opening stuff from Christmas, and we're almost in May. But yeah, thank you for that, James. You have the best supporters out there. Absolutely. I put together a small package for you. It's a mismatch of stuff. Some older Canucks cards and a few more Grant Fears to add to your collection. There isn't anything spectacular in this one. Keep up the great videos, James. I don't know about that one, James, but let's see what you sent once again. And yes, I did get James's package out. I will say that. Okay, let's start with the ones that are just in regular top loaders there. Hopefully they didn't fall out or anything here. <laughs> Okay, starting off here, we got a Kirk McLean, retired canvas. That's 1920 Series 2, right? 1920 Series 2, there you go. Kirk McLean, retired canvas. So that's a nice card there. Looks like it's just a bunch of miscellaneous stuff here. We got some 01 Titanium, private stock of Marcus Naslin there. Not numbered or anything, but nice looking card there. I haven't opened Pacific in a while. I should definitely find some more Pacific. We have Uncle Todd. This is a blue parallel from 03 Titanium there, private stock. I've opened that before. That's the 450. Uncle Todd. So that's nice right there. Also, uh, SB Game Use is coming out soon. I know it's like 250 a box roughly, but Keeter's in there. So I'm excited for that. There's a draft day marks with him on the Thrashers. So that's a big chase card for me there. So next up here, we got a Dan Cluche. This one's a red one. That one's a 299. Titanium there. So there's that. Next up, what the heck is this? Christmas 1999. Got a Mark Messier on the Canucks there. Oh, is this an ornament? Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's an ornament. <laughs> Well, wow, fitting considering how many packages I'm opening from around Christmas time, but there's a Messier with the Canucks ornament. Hey, then we have a Messier again. Aurora Man Advantage Cell Fusions. Okay, is this another weird card? Let me take it out and investigate here. Okay, maybe not. Okay, it's really flimsy there. It's just a weird card there. It doesn't really move. Okay, weird card. It's like half a card. Huh. Oh, look at this. Authentic Game Worn Jersey. Daniel and Henrik City. Is there anything on the... Oh, it's a quad. So who's on the other side? Probably Naslin and Uncle Todd. Maybe Brandon Morrison. Dan Kluche. Yeah, Dan Kluche. Well, that's really cool there. There's Uncle Todd there. From Heads Up. I've opened that before. Enjoyed that product very much there. So that's really cool there. Next up, we got Felix Potvin on the Canucks. So a lot of Canucks cards in here. Kind of weird considering I send James a bunch of Canucks stuff. Well, modern players. But there's Potvin game used jersey. That's cool there. A one titanium. We have a Henrik Sedin. Double sided. So, can you guess who's on the other side? Yeah, Daniel Sedin. There's the uh, young Sedin twins there. That's neat. We got 04 Titanium. I recognize that design. Brendan Morrison to 875. Oh, look at this one. Dan Cloutier. Look at that patch. Love that patch. Got some of that red in there. Is that red or is that like burgundy-ish? But there you go, Dan Cloutier. 10 of 155. Very nice there. Huh. Oh, look at this next card here. Uncle Todd patch. The 265. Love it. Oh, that's really nice there. That one's from uh, 03. Private stock there. Then we have... Oh my gosh, another one. That's O2 Private Stock Titanium Patch. That's 95 of 215. Oh, and we have Brandon Morrison on the other side. That's awesome right there. Geez, some early 2000s Canucks patches there. That's really nice. Oh, uh, look at this card. I don't have this. And a Brandon Perlini, Future Watch Spectrum. This is a gold one, so somebody completed the bounty to get this one. 38 of 50 there. Still looking for the button of him from the cup to complete the rainbow, but do not have that. So that's awesome right there. Then we have this Grant Fuhr. Um, is this McDonald's? Yeah, that's McDonald's right there. 98 McDonald's. McDonald's there has Gretzky and Fear there, so interesting card there. Oh, look at this. Canadian Tire Team Canada. I hope Canadian Tire has another set one of these days. That'd be nice. That set from what? 1718 Upper Deck Team Canada? That was a really nice set. Coast to Coast was pretty good, but the Team Canada one was very nice there, even though I had to buy a bunch of cat food cans to get packs. But there you go, Grant Fear. That's nice. And we got this. Clear Cut Stoppers to 100, so that's a Series 1 case hit, right? 1314 Series 1 there. There you go. Those boxes are like 500 bucks now, which is wild, but there's a Grant Fear there. Nice. 
another one of these series one acetate case hit cards clear cut champions grand fury with the cup there that's 15 of 100 that is 10 11 series one dang but yeah i gotta put all the fear cards together don't i even though 95 percent of them are from james and then again i do have a few other nice ones as well but there's that and then next up here ooh, look at that fear on the kings you don't see that one too often mythology from crown royal there that numbered at all i don't see numbering but that is uh i'm assuming 10 11 crown royal all right game worn piece there of him on the kings that's really cool there and then we have oh no way uncle todd sign of the times don't have that for sure i'll go to the sign of times collection uncle todd that's awesome there now 0304 is probably one of my least favorite designs for the sign of the times it's like a portrait shot pretty much but a nice spot to put the auto at least so there you go uncle todd sign of the times nice what the heck is this card here oh my Ah, oh, this is <laughs> awesome and cursed at the same time. Uh, we got Andrew Raycroft. What year is this? Is this 0405 or 0506? Is it 0405? Yeah, it's 0405. It says right there. Ed Belfour. Yes, Ed Belfour. These all on card G. So Belfour had to acknowledge that he had to sign with Raycroft and he still did it. Uh, and Marty Turco. So 23 to 25. I don't think I have a triple. I only have duels sign at the time. So that's awesome right there. <laughs> Raycroft and Belfour on the same card. We have like one of my favorite goals of all time and then you have andrew raycroft on there i like turco but yeah i mean still a really cool card all right now let's get on to the one touch cards here okay start right here looks like we got gino object be a player auto ice wars on card auto there gino object from 96 be a player there huh nice card there is there licensing on there i don't see the canucks logo it's kind of weird next up ooh, gracial glass gracial glick frick Glacial Graft, Kirk McLean. That's 1920, isn't it? Yeah, 1920 ice. And I do have a bunch of Kirk McLean. So, nice looking card there. Looking forward to ice. So there's that. And we got, oh my gosh. Two of two. Grant Fuhr Artifacts. Dual Stick. It's like the black version there. From 1819 Artifacts. Game used piece there. Pieces, I guess. Grant Fuhr, wow. Awesome card there. Jeez, stick pieces there. And the next card, ooh, look at that. 1516, Honored Materials. That one's the 99. Grant Fuhr. So, another Oilers piece there for Grand Fear there. Doesn't say Oilers, but it definitely is Oilers there. 15, 16. And we have this. I actually have one of these already. I have like a purple piece, but there's Grand Fear. Triptychs. Uh, to 600. So there you go. Grant Fear. So there's that. Next card. We got a Glacial Graphs to 15. Oh my gosh. What year is that? 16, 17 Glacial Graphs to Grant Fear there. That's the black version with the gold ink. Awesome card there. Jeez. Oh my gosh. Enshrinements. That is 16, 17, I would say. Is that the same design as Louis Erickson? 14, 15. I was off. Jeez. I think that's the first year they did Enshrinements. I think 14, 15. There you go. Grant Fear. Another on card auto there to 50. Really nice looking card there. Huh. All right. Let's check out the final handful of cards here oh my gosh got the tops or how many of these what you you sent me one of these before what the heck but it's his rookie but it's from tops archives and there's on card auto this is from like the early 2000s even though fears rookie 8182 what well, says there but i think his card is 8283 right but there you go that's awesome card so cool wow Jeez. Then we have, what the heck? Oh my gosh. What is this? Upper Deck Retro. Signature Collection. Grant Fuhr at a 500. Jeez. Wow. That's from McDonald's. So was that a redemption? It might have been a redemption because I would not have that in a pack. Just saying. Somebody's eating their Big Mac or something. They'll get it all greasy. But wow. Grant Fuhr there. We got two more cards here. I'm not looking. I'm just gonna. Oh. Chronology. Timeless Memories. Another gold ink auto there. Jeez. Is that 1819? Yeah. 1819 Chronology there. Wow. Crazy. Jeez. And the final card from James this time around. <laughs> wow. Signature swatches. Grant Fuhrer. That piece is slightly dirty there on a swatch there, but that is... I actually don't want to say the year, but I think it's 16, 17, 15, 16. It was one of those years, but there you go. Grant Fuhrer. Signature swatches. Jeez. Yeah, guys, there is a package from James. Okay. Grant Fuhr. Oh, my gosh. Just a overload of, like, amazing Grant Fuhr cards. Oh, my God. What the heck? Man. Facial graphs. Got that to two. Just crazy mail there. And then he got this. Like, okay. So, James, once again, you're the best. I got to figure out something nice for you for sure. I mean, now is probably a good time to get Elias stuff. And maybe even Quinn Hughes stuff. But we shall see. So, jeez. Yeah, guys, stay tuned for more breaks to come. And as always... Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.